All right, problem seven. We got all types of stuff here. We need x is less than or equal to four, y is greater than or equal to, and y is less than or equal to x plus one. Remember these lines, x equals four and y equals. y equals is a horizontal line. x equals is a vertical line. So x less than or equal to four. So let's draw the line x equals four. That means every x value, x always has to be four. So here, four, zero, four, one, four, two, four, three, x is always four. So that line is basically a straight line, straight vertical line right here at four. Now, are we gonna shade to the left or the right? Well, it says x is less than or equal to four. So we're shading this direction. It's all points for this guy. Everybody over here is the solution. Let's now look at what the y equals two. Y equals two is right here because the y value is always two. Notice this is x1, y2, x2, y2, x3, y2. So we're always right in here. So that's who we're gonna be graphing. So I'm gonna do this right here, cross it to, it said or equal to, so I made it a solid line. And we're graphing everybody that is greater than that. So we're shading everybody above this line. So right now, I want everybody to the left of this and above this. So right now, I'm dealing with this section all up in here. But I still have one more equation. It wants you to graph also, it needs y to be less than or equal to x plus 1. So i got to look at what that line looks like. That has a y-intercept at 1. It has a slope of 1. So I'll go up 1 to the right 1. Up 1 to the right 1. Up 1. Up over. Up over. It goes to the right, so I'm going to go in that direction. So it does say or equal to, so it's a solid line. So I'm going to draw a solid line here, right like that. And now what happens is I want to be underneath it. So I'm going to be shading underneath it, underneath it, underneath it. Notice I want to be underneath this line, above that line, and to the right of that line. What I've created is a triangle here. That's what I've created. And this is how they do things, certain programs, to create shapes on your computer screens in programming. So we had to shade above that, to the left of that, and underneath that, and it created a triangle there. Problem number seven, pretty little triangle we made.